Welcome to SysEng Quick. My name is John, and today I'll show you how to install the Windows subsystem for Linux, also known as WSL, on Windows 11. These directions should work for Windows 10, but have not been tested. With WSL in the Microsoft Store now, the process is pretty easy. I'm running a clean install of Windows 11 23H2 that's been fully updated. Let's open the Start menu and search for PowerShell. Click Run as Administrator and select Yes when prompted. The default distribution for WSL is Ubuntu, but there are other options. We can get a list by typing WSL dash dash list dash dash online. I actually prefer Debian over Ubuntu, but you can pick anything from this list. We'll install WSL by typing WSL dash dash install dash D Debian. You can change Debian to anything from the list or leave the D option out for the default Ubuntu. Let's select yes when prompted. Don't worry too much about this decision if you're not sure. You can always install additional distributions or change to a different one later. Now that things have been installed, it's saying we need to reboot. So let's do that. Click on the start menu, power icon, and click restart. Let's log back in, and it's now installing Debian GNU Linux. It asks us for a new Unix username. I'm going to choose PVE, and then it wants a password. This will also be your sudo password in WSL. So there we are. We now have WSL installed and Debian. If I do cat etsy os release, you can see we're on Debian GNU Linux 12 bookworm. If I want to access this, I can do so from Windows Terminal. Click the Start menu, search for Terminal, select Terminal. By default, it's going to bring up PowerShell. If we select the arrow, we can choose Debian from the list. And if we prefer Debian to be our default terminal, we can change that in Settings. Let's click the arrow. Click on Settings. Default Profile will change it from Windows PowerShell to Debian. And click Save. And now, whenever we launch Terminal or click the plus icon, we'll get a new Windows Subsystem for Linux Terminal in Debian. And that's all there is to installing WSL on Windows 11. Thanks for watching.